Okay guys, um, what's new for 2025 with the new Z foils? Basically, the mass has not changed from last year. Uh, we have a wider part in the bottom, it's just to um, create more stiffness and less torsion. We have nothing new there. But the biggest change, changes for next year will be the fuses. So we're going to have two fuses. The normal one and the plus 25 is what we call it. It's a bit more forward, so more power. Uh, the reason why we did this is the, to gain again more uh, stiffness and less torsion. As of last year we had a full carbon um, fuse slash, so we cannot create enough stiffness in the connection point. So that's why we changed to a full titanium in the front part and in the carbon part in the back, just to gain uh, more stiffness in the lateral as you can go more thinner and uh, it just makes it much lighter. Um, next to that, we have new back wings with new little shims, which can is easier to apply and we have these little pins to keep it on. Um, the back wings have changed, we have much um, smaller back wings now with a new profile, much more powerful, so that's why we could also go much smaller, a 160 and a 150. To so the front wings, sizes has not changed. We have the same 740, 620 and the 540. The part that changes is that we have a new profile, so it's much more powerful. Uh, it makes it easier to jive, easier to get on the foil, and makes it more controllable. Uh, what also changes the layup of the of the wings, especially in the connection part, and that's just pure to get to gain more stiffness, as you want to be as comfortable as possible. So this is a small explanation of what's coming up in 2025 with the new foils. See you in the water.